Ground ball to first, backhanded by Shinton. Down to second one and back to first. The Rays turn a nifty 3 6 1 double play. Pepio over there on the least. Two to nothing. Rays lead this game, facing Griffin Canning. Pitch swung on and bounced foul. Nice pick up by Brady Williams outside the coaching box at third. The count on Harold Ramirez is a strike. Being a souvenir right there. Just under 19 pitches an inning this year, and so he's okay. Third foul outside the bag. I, just to, to, to take a look, I went back and looked at some of my early games when I was a rookie. Mm -hmm. I'm 21 but years old. But if you pitch them in and you miss by a minuscule, guess what? Elbow flip. Drawing some attention over there, Caballero. Back to the bag. He has against Canning so far this year. There he goes. Got a good jump, and the pitch popped into shallow left, and now. Caballero's going to have to get back. Well, that, that's what you hate. And, and you know, Caballero back in. Pitch out. Nothing doing. Oh, he almost had him over there. He started to go. And Kenny went over there. Right. There's the lead. I mean, that's all it takes. Sometimes that's all it takes to get picked off. But shanowell has got to go a long way with that tag. Definitely thinking about going again. Well, he knows he had it stolen. He'd like to get it back. Chop to third. Down to second base for the force. We have completed four, and the Rays lead two to nothing. On ball, that's going to go through the right side. Shuttlewell is aboard with a one out single. We've seen this all afternoon. Where as soon as Pepio gets a little bit out of whack with that arm side high and away pitch, he goes to that slider and it's worked out for him. It's gotten the back end of play. That one actually got put into play and was able to find the hole on the right side. But it's been pretty interesting because you can tell this afternoon Ryan Pepio has not been comfortable mechanically out on the mound. Not Hitting his spots like he normally does, and yet so contact rate is 82 percent. With him, it's 68, which uh, you know that that changeup has good action. Ooh, that pitch! That pitch to two in the right field. I'm send Palacios back, not yet to the track, and he makes the catch. So a base hit, the man left, no runs. TV timeout brought to you. Shot into center field. Trout back, reaching up to make the catch. Line drive out, one away. High fly ball to left. Ward looking for it and waiting. I'll tell you, he was not all that sure in that last moment adjustment allowed him to make the catch anyway this roof can be tough we talk about it all the time especially with busy teams can't find it and then then he's like oh my and gets back there you know we were talking about that down on the field yesterday with Richie Palacios and he he stressed the importance you can't lose sight of that ball for a second because it's really difficult to pick back up Metrodome used to be really really tough too back in the aughts oh yeah because they can blend Quite easily. The right side down toward the bullpen. Look out, fellas. It's two and one. Ray scored two runs in the first. That's been it. And pop fly to short center. Crowd is there. Three up, three down, two nothing Rays. They reward. It's a strike. A little 
tamper. That's going to roll foul. Picked up by Pinto. Here on Monday. And he swings, and this is a big out right there after the leadoff walk to Trout. Yeah, huge. This is a huge inning for Pepio, and he gets that slider slash cutter hybrid right up there, top of the zone. Looking to beat him to the top side by an inch or two. At 91 miles an hour, he jumped on that pitch, and you know, he's not going to see this portion of the lineup again. And it's the most dangerous. Trout takes off to throw down, and he steals it easily. In head first. His fourth of the year in as many attempts. And he said he wanted to run more. Decent lead, but that high leg kick by Pepio allows him to get to a full head of steam quickly. And he got in there easily. Those matchups, you know. We talk about it all the time. It's an was headed to third. Throw down is high, and he's in there with a stolen base. And a hurried throw by Pinto and made a leaping reception down there. And there's a steal of third. Well, and that's a smart baseball play. He wants to get to third here before this at bat is over. He wants to get there with less than two, so that even even a, a productive out can drive the ball. Those are going to bring the infield in to try to cut that off. And Pepio has also got the. 3-2, the right side foul, slicing into the seats. Pitch. Lifted into right. Palacio is there to make the catch, trying to get into a good position. He uncorks the throw, but Trout will score standing up. And the Angels get on the board. Cut and miss. 2-2. Two, two. The pop fly toward the left. Ramirez coming in toward the line and makes the catch. Left his feet to get there, but he makes the grab. A sliding catch to retire the side. A run for the Angels. Here's out number three. They turn the leadoff walk into a run. Ryan Pepe on the raise lead 2-1. to one. Talk of the house we lived in, maybe. Fortunate for that. They invited me up to Cleveland Municipal Stadium. It's a liner in the center in the leadoff single. Richie Palacios is aboard. They invited me up to Cleveland yeah. Municipal. Tap third charge by Rindon. Barehand. The throw is going to be just in time. That was close. And Rosario thinks he might have beaten that one out. The Rays want to take a look. Well, that's funny, too. Adam Beck, as soon as he made the call. The field is out yeah. at first base. Tampa Bay has challenged. Well, I hope we have a shot of Adam Beck. He makes the call out and then immediately looks into the Rays dugout. Like, do you want to challenge? And, of course, they do, and it looks like they might win this one. Another infield hit for the Rays. Stay tuned. He got there. He's safe. Rosario arriving at the bag. Foot is, is down. There. Yes. Safe by the slimmest of margins. Here is Harold Ramirez. <laughs> and the pitch is. Either way, it's been a big part of their offense. Yes, it has. And there's a big cut by Ramirez. And a chopper to third. Out at second. Safe at first. And there will be men on the corners. Yeah, that was just a slow developing play. The way that Ramirez, we've been watching him get up the first base line. There was no chance you were going to be able to turn that. You see how that long that ball hung in the air. But right there, Harold is flying down that line. Kind of a soft toss, too, to Renhifo. Now it will be Jose Cabo.